Hey, Vesant here. Welcome to another episode of Hidden or Not. Um, since the Clara Chandra drop ability patch is available, if you use 200 Dynam or whatever they're called, um, and exchange it for an ability patch, which allows your Pokemon from normal to a hidden ability. Um, so I'm going to show you both where the hidden one and the non-hidden one if you don't want to grind that. So let's get to it. This episode is about Alteria. All right, so Altiri has two abilities: the regular one, Natural Cure, which um, if the Pokemon has the status on it, it will be healed and withdraw from battle. So it's like ejecting status effect. Uh, burn, paralyze, sleep, poison, and freeze. Then there's the hidden ability, Cloud Nine, which ignores the weather effects when the Pokemon on the field. It pretty much negates the weather effects. All right, so it spawns at Den One Fifty Eight and Den One Fifty Nine. Red Beam and Purple Beam, respectively. Uh, if the Red Beam have a chance of being a regular one, so if you need a regular one, then you go for that one. And But if you want a guaranteed hidden ability, go for the Purple Beam. It has a lower chance. So the Purple Beam is 15% for a 4-star and a 20% for a 5-star and another node that's 20% for a 5-star. Uh, for the Red Beam, it is 15% for 4-star and 25% for a 5-star. And I believe there's another node with another 25% for a 5-star. So... Um, you get to pick and choose. Of course, if you stick with the hidden ability one, right, you will get stuck in hidden ability because there's no way to go backwards. But if you get the ability patch, you can change it. So we're going to go to Slippery Slope right here. Uh, go to the one with the mass layer. We're going to go then right there. Uh, as shown earlier here. So we're just pretty much going to go this den right here. The den that you want. Throw a wishing piece in. I guess I can show you both. We can do the red beam and the purple beam. Um, so the red one is not the one you want, right? You can go click invite others and do the time skip trick. Uh, you press home, settings, system, date time. If you have this on, turn it off. Increase your day by one day. Okay, and then click OK, go back in the game, quit, and now reset the den. You pretty much do this until you get criteria. Pops up or not. Hey, look, here we go. I'm gonna bring my Tracer Pokemon to see what ability he has. Carnivore. By anyone, and we're just gonna go in. Well, let's see if, if it has Cloud 9, then okay. But if it doesn't have Cloud 9, natural cure, that's fine too. That is also fine and dandy. <laughs> All right, natural cure. Okay, so we're gonna do the purple beam after this. I'll show you how you guys can do that. Flying and throw it. Actually, I should use stab. Um, I should have used a fairy move. Oh my god, I forgot. Dragon, dragon flying, right? Cause you could have used a fairy move to have like electricity, but that's fine. Whatever. Follow me. That's a waste of an attack. Get <laughs> them shields up, man. Right. Neutral. Shields up. Five bars. Oh boy. Max Starfall. That's super effective. At Moonblast, okay. It just hit the shield, it doesn't matter, whatever you do, hit it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, with the Clefairy move yet? Oh god, okay, um, we'll see. Oh, didn't, okay, cool. 
Hopefully that activates the next shield. Uh, we're on a roll right now. Sure. Good thing Clefairy's not doing follow me right now. Not needed, man. Not needed. Missile. It's only good if if that's like the last hit on the shield. Because right now they're like doing it, they're just wasting time. Guess we have one more turn. Oh no! Why didn't you attack Lefairy? No. Dude, they don't need heals, man. Oh god. I guess they wanted to heal itself, but. They, if only they did the AI like, oh yeah, I only take this much damage, so the next hit probably around this much damage. Worry about it too much. Oh, Sucker Punch. Okay, cool. So I'm pretty much gonna straight up KO it. Alright, so now I'm gonna do the purple beam after I catch this. Yeah, yeah, I'll catch it. No, wait, I don't need to catch it. Forget this, I don't need to catch it. We'll catch the one with the purple beam. Not catching this. Cause then I can just breed the hidden ability one to get the regular one. I really care about it. <laughs> Alright, so this time you wanna save in front of the den if you want the purple beam. So we're gonna do the trick where we're gonna press home. Once you hit yes on the thing. And if it like so, you see the red glimmer there, you just reset the game. Press X to oh, to close it. And you open it back up. Just keep doing it until you get a purple beam. And I'll see you guys when I actually get the, the thing. <laughs> Alright, so this time I did get a purple beam. <laughs> so we're gonna do the same thing, right? The time skip trick. Uh, yeah, okay, we don't need to do the time skip trick. But if you need a refresher, you just click invite others. Right, you go to your home screen, you go to your settings, date and time. Increase it by one day, click OK, come back, exit out, or reset the den until you get the Alteria. Okay, so I'm gonna switch to my, my Garnivore again. And I'm just gonna show that it has the hidden ability, but I guarantee purple beam DLC. Oh, Nia's here. And we don't need to see the whole battle, okay? But yeah, follow my Twitch. Um, my description down below, Cloud9, there you go. I do stream, I stream Pokemon, Genshin, Animal Crossing so far, and maybe some other games, who knows. But yeah, feel free to tune in the stream. Hopefully see you guys there. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Uh, later days.